Well, I just wanted to make this quick video. A guy was selling this home light with a five horsepower Briggs and Stratton. And he said, or best offer. He didn't even put a price on it. Now it's a home light, 2,500. The model and all is EH2500. Now, you could tell how old these things are for the fact that it still has where you have to actually ground it to the side of the unit. It's got a copper wire with it. Now, what really intrigued me about this is that it actually had, as you can see that bag, I just took them out. It actually had all the old manuals and all with it so i still have the original owner's manual for this model i actually have the maintenance manual for this model for the briggs and stratton motor and i actually have the warranty information for home light which is crazy to have this in such good condition because at the bottom you can see it says 4 of 87. So was that April of 1987? That was made. Now I've done some a little bit of research. So on the other papers in there you actually see um, in May of 1986 for this generator. So 86 to 87 for a generator that I picked up for a large $20. I think that's a pretty good deal. Even if I even if the generator doesn't work, I know I can get the actual motor working. I mean, that's a 5 horse Briggs and Stratton motor. I mean, those things are almost indestructible. I mean, it's got spark. I just checked that. The guy, um, guy said he couldn't get it to run, so I checked the spark. He already put brand new gas in it. It didn't look like he cleaned the carb in it because when I started draining the carb, it had stuff all in it. It doesn't look like he did anything with the oil. You see from the oil, I mean, you can actually, I don't know if you could tell it by the video. But there's actual metal chips and everything else in that. So that's not good. I mean, he's trying to get this thing cranked and saying he can't crank it. And he's not even doing anything to it, really. Now, this might be a little, I mean, this has got a little age on it. It might take me a little bit. I'm going to make a couple videos on it. But I just want to give you a rundown. I mean, the shape of it's ridiculously good. I mean, to still have all the manuals, all the parts are here. To have, still have spark. The fuel is coming out of the bottom of the bowl. Um, so I just wanted to make that. And you'll start seeing some videos where I'm going to completely deconstruct this. And if everything works, I'm actually going to sandblast it and completely remake it. Almost like it was brand new just as a little a little side project figure it'd be something cool to do to bring back the 80s well see y'all guys next time